Hello everyone, I'm Ryan Runge of AECTEarthBlock.com and today I am pointing this earth block wall that's here on our own house in Colorado Springs. Um, we just added this little bedroom addition um, and wanted to do obviously a compressed earth block wall for the structure. And today I'm coming back and pointing uh, the joints <clears throat> and I've done most of it already. But I wanted to demonstrate what's probably the coolest toy I've played with since my neighbor got a G.I. Joe hovercraft back in 1984. Um, this is a quick point pointing tool that attaches to any drill. And uh, I've been kind of playing around with this today and it's, it's working awesome. And um, all it is is there's a little auger down there. You fill this hopper up with your mortar. And when you uh, pull the trigger, it gets that auger going. I don't know if you can see that and it pushes the mortar on through our mortar uh, or I guess pointing material in this case is our what these blocks are made out of and also the mortar is made out of which is about um, 10 parts dirt and one part cement and I've just screened it a little finer and um, mixed that together the water kind of settled on top but this is what I'm putting in the in this little hopper and um, you just, it comes with this scoop. Fill, just kind of fill that up. I've been kind of filling it up about three quarters of the way. Gets a little unwieldy. And then um, I'll just demonstrate what it can do here. I'm gonna need two hands for this, so set this up. next step to this is you take a regular pointing tool that you can get at uh, Lowe's or Home Depot. And I'll start with the, the stuff I laid a few minutes ago, but you just come back and uh, point that on in. And then you give that kind of a few minutes to get a little bit solid. And then you'll come back with the sponge and you can kind of blend this, kind of, kind of smooth it out and Blend it in, and um, I'll, I'll demonstrate that in just a second as well. But uh, I just wanted to kind of show you the whole finish out process for doing something like this. If, you're, if you've got some earth block walls with, that you're gonna leave exposed and you wanna kind of clean up the joints, this is basically how you do it. Okay, I've got all that pointed in, and now I'm just gonna come back with the sponge and uh, just wet it and wring it mostly out, leave a little bit of water, a little bit of water in it. But then you'll just kind of come like this and it's kind of a little bit like doing grout on tile. Just um, smooth it out, kind of blend it in. This is the section I did earlier today, so the, um, the mortar itself is still a little wet, um, but it's starting to come together. This is the section I did yesterday that's dried out, so that's gonna be kind of um, more or less the final look. I'm gonna probably put a kind of a um, sealant on this wall that'll hopefully bring out the color a little more. <laughs> I love the way this wall is coming out, <clears throat> and this, this pointing is um, just kind of putting it over the edge. Just got a little bit more to go, so everything's done except this part down here. And once that's done, we'll have a nice, solid, pointed, finished wall. So, thanks for checking in. Check back for um, some follow-on videos of how we ultimately finish this wall out. Thanks again.